So you want to find out how to level up fast in Steel Rising. Today I'm going to give you every single tip I learned from going from 1 or from 0, I should say, all the way to 100, really relatively fast in the game. And if you follow these tips and suggestions I'm going to mention in the video, you are going to be able to level up super fast in this game. And trust me guys, you guys won't be disappointed on leveling up fast. Leveling should be your number one priority in this game. So if all this sounds interesting, a like would be really appreciated. A subscription would be awesome as well. So let's go ahead and dive in and talk about today's video. So in Steel Rising, guys, it's going to be extremely, extremely important to be able to level up. Now, the reason why it's extremely important to level up, it's because there's a particular currency that's going to allow you to level up that not only levels you up, but it also levels up your weapon. And being able to manage this on when to level up your weapons, when to level yourself up, it's going to be extremely important because as you get higher in levels, you're going to need more and more of this particular item. So let's go ahead and talk about it. So in order to level up, of course, I have to tell you guys, since the demon is you, you're either going to need to visit either a carriage or one of the kind of kiosk sections within the map. As you guys see here, we're already level 100. And I don't know what the max level is here on this game, but I'm assuming that the max level, it's going to be 120 due to the fact that I'm pretty sure you could max out every single, every single core here. Now, if you guys want to see a video on which where you should allocate your points first when it comes to this particular game let me know in the comment section down below because i have a build guide i could give you guys on where you need to allocate these points so talking about leveling up so in order for you guys to level up you're going to need this thing called anima essence now these anima essence is found in multiple ways theoretically the easiest way that you're going to come across of it is be like killing enemies the more enemies you kill the more anima essence you're going to get now with that being said, let's talk about tip number one. So tip number one is going to focus primarily on the early stages of the game, uh, what you want to do. So first things you got to do, guys, is you're going to go to the module slots. And within the module slots, guys, you're going to need to go ahead and activate a module that's going to give you more Anima Essence. Now, what I'm going to do is show you guys exactly where you're going to be able to pick this up and why you should prioritize this extremely fast in the game. Of course, in order for you guys to be able to add a module, you're going to need a module key to unlock the module, and you should get that early in the game. And I want to suggest that's the first one you should prioritize because leveling up is extremely important. Now, the module we're talking about is this one right here called the Grade 1 or the Grade... Yeah, Grade 1 avarice module now this module slightly increases the amount of anima essence taken from each fallen enemy so what this allows you to do guys is every time you kill an enemy you're going to be getting more anima essence back so i think it's it, it goes plus three so i believe when you start that game you end up getting 71 every time you kill a regular ad of course bosses give you more but every time you kill an ad you get 71 with this one you get 74 so it gives you three more and it trust me guys it adds up as you progress the best suggestion i can tell you guys on leveling up is make sure you guys put these tips together and just kill everything you find in sight. All right, so in order for you guys to get this module, it's going to be super easy uh, in the sense of how early you're going to be able to get in the game. After you kill your first mini boss, you're going to progress through the outer area. And as before you get to the main boss in, in the first level, there's going to be an area where you're going to find a Vestal that you're going to be resting in. Now, in this particular Vestal, if you guys go into the boutique, and you go to the purchase section under modules, you're going to notice that this particular module is being able to be purchased for you guys to activate it. So what you want to do, guys, is you want to make sure you have enough anima to purchase that so you guys can get more anima when you guys go ahead and buy it. Once you have it, go ahead and activate it in your module slot. And now you have just a little bit more anima every time you kill a boss. Now, another tip I want to give you guys, and most of you guys who play Souls games, you guys should already know this. Destroy everything you find in the world because you will be finding anima as you kill, as you kind of knock down the barrels and knock down stuff in containers and also the bags in the air. You're going to be able to get a little bit more anima. You don't get anima all the time, but you do find some in the general vicinity. All right, so now that you already have the module already set up in your inventory, you're getting a little bit more anima, you're getting more stuff. We're going to talk about the other way that's going to give you even more anima every time you kill an enemy. So this, the way this works, guys, is you're going to go to your attribute menu. And with your attribute menu, you're going to notice that there are, uh, you know, six different modules here that you're going to be able to upgrade. The one you want to prioritize, guys, is the engineer module. The reason why you guys want to prioritize the engineer module is because this is going to enhance the loot multiplier. So that means every time someone dies or every time you find loot in the ground or every time you kill an enemy, the loot multiplier will give you more loot. And that is only able to be harnessed by uh, enhancing or by upgrading your engineer module. So what I personally did when I first got the game, I put a lot of points into engineer uh, throughout the game. I got it all the way to level 10 and then I started working on my other points. 
because that loop multiplier gave me more anima, gave me more capsules, gave me more stuff to keep my health up, more grenades. And guys, that stuff is so vital for this game. And making sure you get that loop multiplier is going to be extremely important. It did help me out a lot, and I highly recommend you dump some points into Engineer. Even though you're not an engineer, you definitely want that loop multiplier to have it in your arsenal. All right, so the next thing, guys, I want to tell you guys about leveling up, of course, is going to the boutique, and that is going into the cell option. Now, within the cell option, there's going to be certain articles that you're going to be able to get from fallen enemies and, of course, from destroying crates and destroying barrels that are going to give you a lot of anima. And I'm going to show you guys right here. So I have 810 anima. Now, if I come here, guys, and I go to the sell options, this Essence of Warrior Spirit gives me 1,000 anima. If I sell two of them, it's going to give me 2,000. Now, the ones you, this is going to be one that you guys are going to be able to find. So this Essence of Warrior Spirit, this one's pretty much coming off bosses, the majority of them. You have Essence of the Noble Spirit. These are also coming off for many bosses and certain other bosses within the game. And you have the Essence of the Valiant Spirit. This one's going to give you 500. And you have one more, guys, and this is the one that you probably are getting more of, is the Essence of the Lesser Spirit. And I'm going to show you guys right now if if I go here and I click sell, let's say I want to sell all of them. So I'm going to go ahead and sell all the ones I have. So I have 30 of them. We're going to sell all 30 of them. And then when we sell all 30 of them, actually, you could do. This. OK, when we sell, we're going to get 7,500. So that's going to give me guys over 8,000. So we're going to confirm. And as you guys see now, my anima went from went to 8,310. Now, there's a way to actually farm this anima essence. And there's a way to actually farm these. Now, if you want me to put up a farming video, guys, let's try to get this video to 500 likes. If we get to 500 likes, let's, I think we could do it. And I will definitely be putting that farming video for you guys because it does break the game. So I, let's get this video to 500 likes and make it happen. So as you guys know, when you get Essence of the Spirits, you're going to be able to sell it. So I'm going to show you guys right here if I want to sell this as well to see that how this works. So I'm just going to keep uh, two more. So I'm going to confirm. And now I'll add them 18. And if I go to this one right here, of course, that's going to give me more. So let's go ahead and do that. And we're going to sell, let's sell 15 of these. And we're confirmed that puts me at 29 so this is a very fast way of actually leveling up now you don't get these often so you're going to want to make sure you prioritize when you're leveling up of course don't do it when you think you're going to die do it when you're at a place and you have stuff to buy so you guys can go ahead and level up really fast and really easily i want to make sure i state this correctly guys destroy everything you find in the ground it's going to help you guys level up super quick and super fast now guys one important thing if you guys are still on the fence deciding if you should pick up this game or not i highly recommend you guys check out my review that's popping up right now on the screen or check out this video that's telling you what's the best weapon to use currently in the game now if you want to purchase this game guys click the link down below it's an affiliate link from amazon to get a physical copy of the game it's probably at a cheaper price so you might save yourself a couple money thank you guys for watching this video you guys are awesome thank you for all the support do consider subscribing turning on all your notifications so you guys won't miss when our videos go live thank you guys for watching guys and i will catch you guys on the next video